Hello everyone, we are from group A. We will present about effect of light on rice weevil or Cetophilus oryzae population. Next. Let me introduce our member group. First is my friends, Humam Yusuf Abdusalam, with student number 215. And my name is Erina Indira Mulyani, with student number 219A. And Ali Piyandra Sani Putra, with student number 208. Next. The background is our presentation is warehouse space as a result can cause economic losses in the form of quantity loss and quality loss, change in color and taste, decrease nutritional value and contamination by dirt and insect body parts. Warehouse pests carry out their activities at night. This indicates that the pest is good at using dark light to make it safe for itself and carrying out all its activities. Different colors of light will radiate different wavelengths. The greater the energy radiate, the greater the increase in temperature it causes in a fixed or constant unit area. The influence of light or dark and light condition is very influential on the behavior of insects in choosing food and copulating. Next. The purpose from our development is the paper. The purpose from this paper is to know the effect of light on rice level development and population. Next. Rice weevil or Cetophilus oryzae. Cetophilus oryzae is one of important pests attacking agriculture commodities such as cereals. Weight loss of rice during the storage period is caused by feeding activities of both larvae and adults, causing economic losses. The environment suitable for the development of this space is a temperature of 25 until 27 degrees Celsius and 70% humidity. The time span of immature development depends on the quality of the rice and the temperature of the storage environment. Next. And then uh, rice weevil are nocturnal pests. <clears throat> rice weevil are nocturnal pests and frequent dark places. The higher the light intensity, the longer the emitted wavelength, the more energy it produces. The greater the energy radiated, the greater the increase in temperature it causes in a fixed or constant unit area. The increase in temperature will also affect the humidity of the air. And this is uh, the result and discussion. It's a table of observational result. There are three parameters. The first one is always dark, and then near window, half dark, half light, and always bright. The number of rice we fill uh, per 27 May is 32 with always dark, 11 near window, and then seven always bright, and increase in 28 June with uh, 245 in always dark, 28 in near window and 20 in always bright. Okay, the observation aims to determine the relationship between the rice beetle population with light. Observation of the rice weevil population to light was carried out by inserting 10 rice beetles, Cetophilus oryzae linnaeus, five males and five females into three different containers, then given 100 grams of rice each container as a control and the difference in light treatment as an independent variable. The three light treatments are always dark near the window with the assumption that during the day it is exposed to light and when it's dark at night and the treatment is always bright or given artificial lightning. There is some picture. Observation took place for uh, four, four months from March to June 20 and 21. The population was observed two times, namely on 27 May and 28 June 20 and 21 with an observation interval of one month. Also added 100 grams of rice per container. The first observa observation of 27 May 21, 2021 were 32 in always dark condition, 20, uh, 11 in condition near the window, and 7 in always light condition. 
The second observation on June 28, 2021, the population increased to 45 in the always shock treatment, 28 in the window treatment, and 20 in the always light treatment. In the always shock treatment, no lights hits the flea storage container. This causes a decrease in environmental temperature that affects the development of Cetophilus oryzae from eggs to larvae. This is, uh, we can see the picture. Fifteen percent until seventeen percent humidity supports the development of the rice we feel. The presence of high temperature make the activity of flying rice beetle eggs quickly so that the eggs become few. Conversely, at lower temperature, egg laying activity becomes longer. So that condition are always stuck is optimal enough for the breeding or its rice within. In the treatment near the window, which is assumed to be during the day when it is bright and it's night, it's dark so that it's more depends. The population of rice within is also increased, although not as high as in always dark condition. Continuous lighting disperses la rice within nocturnal lifestyle and makes the female eggs more quickly due to temperature. Based on observation, always dark treatment is more optimal in the development of rice within put things aside, things outside the variables. Next. From this, the conclusion from the observation, it can be concluded that there is an effect on light on the population of the rice we feel, Stoplus orisae, the treatment that had the highest effect was always dark, which was related to the nocturnal nature of the rice beetle, lower temperature and higher humidity. Next. Okay, this is from our group. Thank you.